Live from the world's capital markets, here are the financial headlines brought to you by Vantage. Hello and welcome to Wednesday's financial news. Stay with us for more market headlines. All three major US stock indexes veered sharply lower, snapping four-day winning streaks and notching their biggest one-day percentage drops since June 2020 during the throes of the COVID-19 pandemic. Terra's Luna mooned last week as the rebooted version of the crypto token surged 247%. But while the token has still picked up massive value over the last week, the ascent has stopped. Now it's down by more than a third from its recent peak. Bank of America revised its forecast for the peak in Bank of England interest rates to 4% from a previous estimate of 3.25%, saying the central bank would need to tighten policy more to offset fiscal stimulus from Prime Minister Liz Truss. The Bitcoin dollar pair fell 9.5% in the last session, after gaining as much as 1.5% during the session. The ROC's negative signal is in line with the overall technical analysis. The gold dollar pair plummeted 1.3% in the last session. The ultimate oscillator's negative signal is in line with the overall technical analysis. Microsoft shares dropped 2.5% in the last session. The MACD's negative signal is in line with the overall technical analysis. The Aussie dollar pair dove 2.3% in the last session. According to the Williams indicator, we are in an oversold market. Japan's imports will be released at 2350 GMT the UK's core consumer price index at 0600 hours GMT, the Eurozone's industrial production at 0900 hours GMT. Japan's exports will be released at 2350 GMT, the US producer price index at 1230 GMT, the UK's consumer price index at 0600 hours GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Wednesday's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.